The topic of this video is going to be another Arch Linux B minimal version. Mate is the latest build we've created and there is not yet a tutorial. Now, if once you've built a few of them, you start to realize that they are all the same. So in this case, we have a package file that we are going to hashtag out applications. Say we don't want to have three browsers, just one is good enough for me. I don't want all these uh, uh, creative tools like GIMP and Inkscape and all that. Just want to have watch a video on VLC and that's it. So you choose whatever comes on your system. That's what is called Article Linux B. Build it yourself, the B, right? So there are lots of choices and we've chosen now to make an Article Linux B minimal for Mate. So let's do it. Where do we find these informations? Always in the same place. So any of these links will be just fine. The thing is, it's going to be on another GitHub. So this one, this URL, is going to be just replaced with Mate. That's it. Instead of awesome, we're going to install Mate. So that's not going to work, but this is. So we have here the GitHub Arch Linux B. Well, lots of choices here, lots of choices indeed. And Mate Minimal has been updated two days ago, I see. And the only thing you need to get is this URL. So get this line here. Article Linux B and all the scripts you need are going to be included. So that's basically it. Get the code, run 30, walk away, and you have an ISO. Okay, let's do it together. So desktop, let's go to here, open terminal here. Let's move that one. It's This is open box, by the way. So I'm going to use the super key and a four. And so I'm going to tile it like this you can tile it any way you want it you see how it works and that's this how you can do it git clone and then Control shift v get the code from the net let's build article mate multi minimal we can get rid of this we need to go inside here and we don't want to see the dot git it's not important so Control h it's gone we don't see it anymore all gibberish, all just information. The only thing you need is these two folders. One is your packages, your choice of packages. This is just Arch Linux, the core packages. It becomes more and more interesting if you start here, software from Arch repos. So a lot of things have been hashtagged out already. So we're keeping Genie, that means, good tip, let's include it in the tutorial. Put this thing here to Perl. Then everything comes black, white, and you see very easy what things are going to be included on your system. So if you see something here, you say, ah, oh, no, don't want to have it to be parted. Just put a hashtag in front of it, like so, and it's the gone. It's not on the ISO. So that's the point. And if you want to have some games, we have included some games. We are not gamers, but there are Steam here and Steam and then Lutris and Sour Brat and, and Xonautic. So a few games are here, just add them. Uh, anything that's in the Arch repos can be added here. Anything that's from the AOR, put it in a script, let it run and walk away and you have a full system again. So not everything is needed. Obviously, all the things for open box are not needed in Mate and so on and so on. So if we have done that selection, we've done that train of thought for you but you can always change, you can always say no, I really want to have it. And these are of course the Mate stuff. So we need those as well. So change whatever you want to change. And then you go to installation scripts. We have here only number 30 that's important for you guys. This is just for me to move what I created to my own documents or to move it to the beta tester. So that's just for me, maintenance, administration. You go and run number 30. All right, you need to have some place, obviously, but I don't think that space is a problem anymore on hard disks. It might be if you are in a virtual box environment and you did not give it enough gigabytes, but um, most of the time that's not an issue at all. So I can keep on talking, but in, the, in essence, we have to wait till this thing stops running 
until there is an ISO and then we can put it in the virtual box and we can test it out and if we say no I don't want that application that application was not what I intended to install etc etc you just change the package dot x86 here again so that one that one in here change it again put a hashtag in front of it I recommend you put a hashtag in front rather than deleting lines it's easier later on if you git pull it again if you get it again from the net compare your two folders with melt and then you'll see instantly okay they've changed or added new packages etc etc all right i'm shutting up and waiting for the iso and there we go you check the time up here how long it takes for me to build an iso and if he's moved it already to arc linux b out as well so eric arc linux b out and this is the minimal of today let's have a look that's true so date modified is the 23rd of october 16 o'clock or 4 50 seconds so it's 1.4 gig they're all around uh, 1.3.4 in size because we've eliminated 600 megabytes in software that's just that applications gimp etc inkscape a lot of things have uh, been uninstalled or not installed so there you go now if you want to test it out you have to uh, use probably best uh, ignore best virtual box let's move it over here i have this template which i clone which is easier and then we just can type whatever it's going to be and everything is set already like this full clone so the CPU is set, how many cores I have, etc, etc. So, um, yeah, we need to tell them where, where the file is. Um, let's do it like this. Optical drive, choose disk image. This is the D version. Uh, we have built the B version, B out, minimal. You can make it a little bit bigger, so you can select on the date. So this is the very, very last one. Made minimal, mate, minimal. Double click, double click, and I hope it stays on this screen. Okay, full screen. So there we go. We have lift off. We created our own Arch Linux Mate Minimal. And I must say it feels really, really good on uh, SSD. It's uh, flying. So Mate, they do say that it's, um, oh yeah, we have fixed in the meantime, we have fixed thanks to the help of the Calamaris guys how to get again a GEO -E IP so location so that uh, he knows where you're at and I hear that sometimes people have to correct it anyway but hey it's working again so it's fine it doesn't cost us any money also fine I'm erasing everything and let him do his job you know the drill whoops capital so this is Mate and it's minimal and I don't want to log in oh, I do want to log in automatically which is not gonna work because everything is set for XFCE so it does not expect it to be M-A-T-E all right so if you have to change it manually in the etc lightm lightm.conf there it is replace all the XFCEs with Mate and you're done all explained on arclinux.b would be silly to make a package for that so i'm gonna wait for this installation and then we'll have a look right all right i was doing something else restarting now and let's see how it looks it does not reboot it can sometimes happen um, and then you have to well shut, hard shut down so Control f and then just click down here click here and then we have this uh, yeah, I'm gonna shut down here my uh, where is it now okay never mind so what I was going to say is just shut down everything like this power of the machine and then uh, you can for instance get rid of this image here so you actually boot up like you're supposed to boot up right like this so let's have a look what is Mate minimal what does it look like we try not to uh, if this happens that's okay just log in and log out 
if it doesn't work. So sometimes it stays small and then you have to log out again. And then if you do that, that's, then you'll see that LightDM says, oh, I have more screen than I thought. And then everything is again bigger. So don't show this message, don't want this. So what I was saying is we've left, um, we did not change a lot of things as a wallpaper, yeah. But for the rest, with uh, keyboard shortcuts, for instance, are not present. Um, lots of things are not present. So it's still a very virgin mate in the sense that there are lots of um, software that's missing, that's just not there. But on the other hand, there are also stuff like this fixed hard code icons. You know that we have um, developers who still have hard coded paths. So whatever team you choose, it's always that icon. So this little thing fixes that. There are still two people here who need to fix their, um, well, their icons. Simple as that. So there's some things that are interesting and some things that are like the Inksy. What is it? Gparted, disks, all kind of applications. Conky Zen is here, Mate Tweak. That's something extra we put on the ISO. It's a little application to do some stuff with uh, your system here. And there's another one, which is actually a menu out to the panel. So if you just type menu, you just choose whatever menu you'd like to see that one, that one, or that one. So this is how uh, Mate looks, of how it looks like, how it feels is quite fast, honestly. So even on the virtual box, it does not feel very slow. Still have an icon to fix for that one. I've noted it, it's on my to-do list. And here are the, all the elements you can choose. So it's, it's a lot of um, elements, but they're all coming from Mate. Yeah, and printing, of course. So it's a lot of uh, possibilities to choose. All right, so that's it. Um, enjoy tweaking your system to the way you want it. That's the whole point of Arc Linux B. Build it yourself the way you see fit. And then it becomes just a rolling release again. So update everything. There are only two commands you really have to know. And that's update. Let's go to system tools, termite. So update your system with update. Oh, let's just show you the aliases first. So this is the stuff you need to take a look at. And update is just Pacman updating everything. Everything is then the Arch Linux and the Arco Linux. That's it, that's everything. If you want to do the rest, you have to do a PKS YOA and that's gonna get then everything plus AOR. But um, nothing to be done, of course, we've just built it. So there you go, uh, have fun rolling uh, this Arco Linux B Mate out and choosing your software that you like, put it on the ISO, test it out, and report back on Discord, YouTube, anywhere. All right, cheers.